have a look. Power adapter, Ethernet cable. Pretty cool. So these antenna actually move side to side as well as up and down. Two LAN connections at the back here, your WAN, your power. So it looks like the power would just plug into here. And then our connection will go from here to our modem. So let's actually plug this in and have a look at getting it set up. Okay, so the setup on the modem was pretty straightforward. We run an ethernet cable out the back of our standard modem. I've got an Asus gaming modem router, but we run the network cable out of that into the back of the WAV link. That goes directly into the WAN port at the back there. And then you plug your power in. Basically that will then provide internet. This basically creates a Wi-Fi bubble in your home, which will give you a certain amount of distance from this base station for Wi-Fi coverage. But the beautiful part about a mesh network is that you can buy multiple of these and set them up in different areas of the house, pair them together. And what that will do is expand your Wi-Fi network throughout your home. So that's the beauty of the mesh network. So once we've got all that plugged in, basically we just turn the router on. You'll see all your lights come on, telling you whether you've got power, Wi-Fi, your wireless LAN plugged in. And then if you've got any other device plugged into your two other LAN connections at the back, you'll see activity through these lights here. These antennas as well, they are bi-directional, as I mentioned earlier. But what that means is when you, have a house that has the, that is quite big you obviously want to be able to move these antennas around to adjust that bubble of where you want the internet to sort of go so i love the fact that it's 2.4 and 5 gigahertz so 2.4 will often give you longer range from the base but your 5 gigahertz will usually gives you better speed but it doesn't penetrate through walls as well so we'll jump over to the computer and i'll just show you what the login screen looks like and some of the settings that you have available to you 